Oh, I do have an ESC. Oh, 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 jeez. I've been having a blast with RC planes this year. I started off at the beginning of the year with a lot of warbirds and love for warbirds, and then I got into jets through the heat of the summer. That was a blast. We flew three different jets, and everyone said the next step is either a bigger jet or 3D planes. Well, here you go, 3D plane. Look for at that smile. I know. <laughs> I've wanted to take a step in this direction for a while, and I just didn't know which way to go, and it was kind of the same feeling with jets. I, I looked at jets and I thought, even EDF jets, they're EDFs. Uh, and I thought, man, those just look scary. But they're not, they're just like any other plane. So I'm hoping that this will be a somewhat similar experience. I don't expect to put this in the air and fly amazing 3D pilot skills, but I do expect to have some fun and hopefully learn some of those tricks and maneuvers and skills through the next year or two. And so I can't learn them if I don't have the plane. Well, today's the day we put this in the air. This is the Voltagier. I think it's about a year old or so. Uh, it's a Hobby King Voltagier, and we'll have a link in the description box below if you like it. I'll also do my best to link my transmitter and receiver combo, my battery that I'm using, because it's always important to make sure you're getting a good battery. Today we're going to do a Maiden, uh, which should be fun. This is capable of flying on 3S or 4S, so I'm going to start off tame with a 3S pack, 2200. Same with 4S, it'll be 2200 when I eventually get there. Hopefully it stays in one piece today. This is a maiden flight of my first true 3D plane. So I wanted to share that experience with you guys. Wish me luck. I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm alive, I'm having fun. Let's go play with the plane. <laughs> I'm scared for a few different reasons. One, my wheel doesn't turn, so I don't know how it's even gonna take off if it can at all. And two, my elevator is acting weird. Uh, I never use this transmitter receiver combo, but it was recommended to pair with this, uh, and I've had it forever. Mm. Here we go. Oh my gosh, yeah, I went yeah. straight up. Nice. Hey, that's cool. Okay, let's just make sure everything's all trimmed up nicely. 3D plane. First time flyer for 3D. A little gusty, so maybe it's even too windy for this, but um, yeah, 3S pack in here. Let's have some fun. Nice. Okay, this is fun. <laughs> Something just fell on the ground and I thought it was like your plane like oh, dying Oh, really? It's probably epically. some dirt from that <laughs> little mud. Or the, uh, maybe it was the gate. Maybe it's the gate creaking. Oh yeah, back behind us. Yeah. Look at you go. Yeah, I'm just trying to get a feel for everything right now. It's actually, I got all the surfaces paired up and tri you know trimmed up nicely. Um, I didn't have to trim anything. It might have a little bit of climb, but that's it. And I know I'm flying far away, but I'm just getting a feel for this thing. You're not yeah. far away on camera. Okay, You're fine. cool. Look at you go. Guys, I've never seen Nate fly oh, like this. I'm being quiet, but I'm just trying to play well, with I'm this talking for you. <laughs> and just do some stuff that I normally wouldn't do. Let's I've never seen you do something like that before. I've seen never the, had a plane that, that can, can do, do it. I know, yeah. that's why I'm excited. Ah, Whoa. just fell out of it, which is pretty common to, to do. Um, oh, what can I do? I don't know. I don't know the moves that this is supposed to do to look good. This is a maiden 3D Flight. First 3D plane. First 3D plane. Now, I've played with 3D planes on flight simulators, but not enough to come out here and, you know, brag or anything. <laughs> uh, let's do something just like crazy, like... What in the world? <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll hit this. Let's go. Uh... <laughs> Are you stumped? It's, like, what, yeah, what do Yeah, like, do? I just don't know what to do. I know I can do my normal, slow, boring passes and stuff, but with this, I just don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Just throwing the sticks in a bunch of different directions. I think your sound effects are the best thing about it. Look at you guys, look. What do you think? 
It's fun. <laughs> when when's the last time I was this quiet flying a plane, Abby? Never. Look at that. Look at me. Look at that. I have never done this before. Would you look at that? Yeah. Just look at it. <laughs> oh, don't fall out of it. Don't fall yeah, out. Yeah, you're of it. not very high. Ooh. You I was pretty low on that one yeah, shot. You don't have to uh, fly so low. No, I just need to. You need to practice. Keep practicing. You're right. Uh, we should be able to do some pretty good knife edging with this, but that doesn't mean that I can. So. I will try it on this next pass. We know what happened the last time you knife edged uh, on yeah, a maiden. Yeah, that was with a jet on a maiden. But you know what, Death Valley? I'm going to knife edge over you and not crash. How's that? How's that, Death Valley? And then you can climb into a loop with the knife edge, but I can't because I'm not good enough. <laughs> Man, this is fun. This is really fun. Nate put wow. a lipo alarm in there. Yeah. We really don't know how long this is gonna last. A little inverted. Nice. Climb out of that. Very pretty. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I liked it. I was impressed. Oh man, this is a cool plane. That was fast. Do some more rolls like that. Those are snappy. Oh man. Oh, oh, Give oh. us some juice. We're okay. <laughs> So when, when all else fails at that altitude, you just give it some throttle and try to pull up and... Oh man, so much concentration. So much concentration. Wow. Oh, this is fun. So much fun. Oh, I've taken the airplane thing to the next level this year and I'm so happy I have. I, I do still feel like I need to trim. I, I haven't trimmed anything yet, so just a touch of trim on the down elevator. Uh, yeah, so you said you like the fast rolls? Yeah, I do. They do look good, you. don't they? How many was that? Three? A uh, few. That's awesome. Wow, this is crazy. I mean, the stuff I'm doing doesn't look good at all, but wow! <laughs> wow, it's fun. I think it looks good. <laughs> it's just crazy <laughs> random stuff. But Isn't that what 3D planes are? Well, there's usually a pattern and like a... Like, we'll learn, you'll learn. Yeah. Yeah. I'll learn how to film it, you'll learn how to fly it. <laughs> Sounds good. I just like the vertical hover, even with the wind there. This plane is fully capable of it. Man, that is so cool. And I know I'm not totally good. <laughs> Shh, no one was going to say anything. <laughs> sure they are. No. That's what comments are for. No. Oh, man. Wow, this is cool. Oh, I do have an ESC. Oh, 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 oh geez. We saved it, we saved it. We saved it. But just barely. If it was two feet lower, that would have ended badly. <laughs> okay, so tonight I'll be playing on the flight simulator. and Watching uh, videos to learn how to do Watching videos, how to do anything better than what I'm doing now on my 3D plane here. That was fun, but just chaotic craziness. And. Can I knife edge? No, not really. I'm bad at knife edging. I gotta get better. Well, you're at like a six minute flight. That's awesome. Yeah. I've got my lipo alarm set, so I really am not worried about that. I'm just gonna keep having fun. Oh, look at that. That is a torque roll on complete accident. I did one full 360 torque roll. Does that mean like it was vertical so the, and you the, did yeah, a roll? Uh -huh. And it uses the torque of the motor to, uh, to make it roll, to spin. Or is it called a torque spin? I think that's called a torque roll. I have Educate a lot of us. <laughs> maneuvers to learn and a lot of. Whew, just a lot. Yeah, I've got a lot to learn now with this. <laughs> a lot, but I, I'm feeling really good. Like, I think I picked out a good first 3D plane. This is probably not one that a lot of people would highly recommend, but I wanted something. There's my. There alarm. you go. I wanted something foam and I wanted something that could handle the packs that I have but also a good size. So thinking that that's a 3S pack, um, I'm excited to try 4S, but not, not anytime soon. I am just gonna keep flying 3S because this is more than powerful enough. And I'm trying to land with my nose into the wind, you guys. That's why I'm going down here like this. Oh my gosh, this is just crazy. Yeah, the wind picked up for you. Yeah. Wow. Is it like super sensitive? I look like a crazy person, don't I? Yeah, it's a little yeah. sensitive, but man, that was fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Woo.
I think I know why it was so hard to land. I literally just took the canopy off and I took my LiPo alarm out because it was going crazy and it looked just like that. My battery came loose and so that was such a squirrely landing because the CG was way off. I thought it was wind but it was the battery getting tossed around in there. So uh, although they have the Velcro strap, I need to put some Velcro on that wood yeah. uh, because I always have Velcro on my batteries. So easy, easy, easy fix. So there you go, guys. Yeah. That that was an amazing, fun, not amazing, but it was a fun maiden. Guys, give Nate some props in the comments below. I am super proud of him. I uh, told him already, I'm super proud of him. So uh, let him know, give him some good positive vibes, tell him ways that he can improve. I'm excited yeah, for Yeah, yeah, I need some tips. So if any of you guys are 3D pilots watching this and you're just like, oh, cringe, cringe, cringe the whole time, just give me a little bit of like, maybe what's one of the first easier uh, 3D maneuvers that I could learn and then I'll take it upon myself to go try to do that. I love planes and I love progressing in this hobby and showing progression and and sharing that experience with you guys that's why i wanted you to see my maiden of my very first 3d plane ever i have a little bit of flight on flight sims but trust me that was nothing like real life i mean flight sims they are but just the adrenaline and the realness of it just you don't get that on the flight sim maybe the first few times you do that on a flight sim but i am so excited to learn some stuff with this and just carry that through my next entire life of this, this amazing hobby uh, I had a blast. Hopefully you guys had some fun watching. And this this is windy now. So I gotta do a couple little things on the plane. Add a Velcro strip, check out what's going on with my elevator. Maybe do a couple swaps of the servo or something. I don't know, it held up fine on that flight. But I had so much fun. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. All this good stuff, battery, plane, everything will be linked in the description box below. We'll see you in the next video. Bye!